Using Claude code inside a cursor with Webflow is an absolute game changer. Go to github.com, click on sign up, and just create an account straight away. Once you've got your GitHub account, go to Netlify and then log in with GitHub, okay? Go to GitHub, you can click new here, and you can create a new repository, and you're gonna click create repository. And clone repo to get cursor going, and we can clone from GitHub. I'm gonna clone Sprint, this one that we just created over here. I'm gonna go over to cursor's chat, and just paste in what we copied from Claude Code and hit enter. It will tell you that Claude Code is ready to use and that's as simple as it is. Hit terminal here, we hit new terminal, we will be able to go here and just type in Claude lowercase and hit enter and now we've got Claude Code working inside of Cursor. So this is where we're gonna do our AI work, not necessarily using the Claude chat over here so you can close this, minimize it, whatever you want. So now we'll have Claude code going off and writing that script for us. So now we can copy this URL. We can go into our Webflow project over here. I'm gonna go into the body tag and I'm gonna say script source equals. I'm gonna close that and let's see, there we go. So you can see now that we can click these and it pre-fills the input fields. Try this yourself. If you're comfortable doing this, you can build incredible applications using Webflow, Claude code and cursor right away.